What's up guys? I'm back with another love Kami. Let's get started. Alright, so let's see if, if they got in. It was just proof that the preliminaries were a hot event. Oh, what? What, what is Sarah doing? Oh, they're performing as well. Her sister looked a bit like her. She does a lot. Asena, Sarah took the mic and stepped forward. Oh, it's just hope, you know, hope Kagura or Shuri got in, or maybe both of them, it's better if both of them got in, and then they had to fight in the final round. She unrolled the paper in her hand and read it off, and read off it. Oh, Kagura got in! Congrats! Congrats! Yep. It was. You made it. Oh, what? The tree. Oh, she's crying. That's pretty cute. Oh, it makes me sad too. She started crying out of pure joy. It seemed like lots of fans had gathered and all of them were clapping for her. Next came fourth place, Ben Third. Oh no. Sure, I want Shuri at least get in, you know, I like her too. Shuri's name still hadn't come up. Sixth place and below still had been announced, so everyone was tense. Oh, she got in too! Congrats, Shuri. Wow, she got second place. I wonder who got first. She stood there, blown away. Up on stage, her sister seemed quite surprised too. You did it, Shuri. Yeah, it's better if they both face off at the final round. It makes it better, you know. They're like, they'll be like, let's just have one final battle. She was still having trouble taking it all in and stood there kind of lost. Meanwhile, the first place winner was announced. To beat out Shuri by around hundred by around 10,000 votes. It was quite close when you think about well, how well you known you were. How known, how well known they were. Oh. They then call out the names who won the power ones. In one month's time. Wow. There was only a month left until finals. There's going to be one month of work trying to get to a level beyond the competition. Oh, what's this? What? Are you serious? Wow. Just, she's so young, but why is, the, why is she ending her career like that? After making an announcement ever so softly, Sarah put down the mic and walked off stage. So you're telling me then now they need two? people. It looked like Sal was the one who left everyone in awe that afternoon. So if she retires then you're telling me they need two people to get in. So what if Shuri and Kagura got in? Why but like she's so young she's still got like years ahead of her. Yeah I know. I'm not in agreement. We just watched them announce the auditions preliminary results. We couldn't hide our surprise when Sarah suddenly announced her retirement plans too. People all over TV and the net were showing the same shock. I wanna know. I like Sarah too. Shuri seemed to be taking it particularly hard. She looked so unhappy thinking about Sarah. But of course that was only natural. A role model, someone she had aspired to be, was leaving that very stage. I don't, I don't really know what the reason is, but maybe she dislikes it. 
Maybe she just wants both of them to get in. Maybe she wants both of them to get in. I'm not sure. But I think that's still not a good thing, man. Give me up your career for someone else. As for Kagura, while she was surprised, it didn't look like she was in real shock. She was talking like her usual, cheerful self. She went on her own way and always stayed positive. She looks up to all the idols. That's why. Well then, guess you'd better buckle down and pass the audition. Shri was looking at me, apparently confused. Well, if you become a member of L7, then you can find why I, you can find out why Sarah quit, and then maybe come to understand her feelings more. Wise words, man. I don't, I don't know if it's wise. Or will you quit trying to become an idol because of this, Shuri? Why would you quit now? You just got in and you just like, oh yeah, I'm out. I'm done. Just why? Shuri looked at me with resolve in her eyes. I reckon the ending is about both uh, is both them getting in because like they need seven if Sarah quits it's down to five members so they need two more I'm guessing maybe I'm not sure somehow Shuri had come back from a shock as a supporter throughout the qualifier I wanted, both, I wanted them both to keep doing their best just remember the bar is going to be a lot higher to pass the audition you've got to be ready for that yeah, I'm sure you do. But actually, I think Sarah's announcement changes things a bit. Well, I doubt Sarah intended it, but I imagine that this will result in a new member being looked at as her replacement, right? Yeah, I knew it. Two people. True seemed to understand what I was trying to say and let out a small sigh. That means the audition is going to be getting a whole lot of attention. Oh, maybe I'm wrong, I'm not sure. Yep, exactly. Shuri asked Kogoro, who was nod nodding sag sagely? Sagly? I don't know. Oh, I guess Shuri gave up trying to explain. But actually, for Kagura, it likely didn't matter much one way or other. She just liked making everyone happy and did it the way she wanted. That was her main strength and her biggest appeal. Let's go. They were both smiling and there was a spark of tension in the air. However, it wasn't unpleasant. Rather, if felt uh, almost like they were enjoying it. It's likely that because they joined up in the qualifier, they learned about their true abilities and came to accept one another. For some reason, that made me really happy. What? Was I right about two people? Shuri cocked her head in in confusion at Kagura's words. I don't really get what she means. You gotta battle each other out. She's gonna get sad because three of them's gonna have to split up. It was the perfect argument, leaving no room for a counter. Kagura looked to me for help, but all I could do was shake my head. Aww. 
To be honest, it's best not to perform together. It's best to perform by yourselves. Yeah. But who knows, if, if, what if none of them makes it in? You know what I mean? That would be the, the crappiest ending, none of them makes it in. It's sad, but there's no use fighting it, Kagura. You understand what Shuri is saying, don't you? As I said this with Kagura, she seemed to grow ever more unhappy. For the time being, it was important that she see for herself. There was no good in forcing her. Of course, if I were to be honest, it made me feel a little lonely too. I don't know. Kagura slid in close to me as she asked. Yes, of course I will. I'm happy to do anything I can. At my answer, Kagura started hopping around the room in happiness. At any rate, I had already promised to help out. Whoa, whoa, she's too happy. Shouting happily, Kagura suddenly grabbed me in a tight embrace. I was completely thrown by the unexpected move and I could feel something soft pressing up against me. Didn't really have to bring that up, but hey, makes me imagine what it felt like. I mean, not felt like, like imagine what it meant like. What? What are you talking about? I'm not red at all. I don't think that happens in real life. Like, let's say a girl like comes up close to you or something and hugs you. I don't think you get red face, dude. That doesn't work like that. Kagura asked her, her face all innocent. Whose fault did she think it was? How unfair! It's nothing. Just, you can let it go now. Hi. When I said this, Kagura finally released me. I kind of regretted it, once all of that softness disappeared. Yet so young, that big breast. So young. She, she has to be young, you right? Like 20? Boy, oh, but they're both still in school, but... So, 17? 18? Oh my god, that is young. I don't know, I might be wrong. Sure he said, glaring at me for some reason. Suddenly, I was very afraid. Come on, Shuri. I know you're gonna be lonely without Yamato. Oh, that's a bit sad. After saying all of this in a rush, she returned and left the shop. This left Kagura and I alone. Yeah, I could tell she wanted to work uh, one last time, you know. You think so? Maybe she's just mad because you were teasing her. Oh my god. Kagura puffed out her chest, full of confidence. Her chest being quite generous. That's quite substantially as a result. But I can't I kinda got like mind if right there substantially. Oh, um, well, I suddenly noticed Kagura glaring at me, trying to throw her off. I suck my tongue out cutely. Dude. Oh, come on now. Guys can't help but be me mesmerized. mesmerized by a woman's chest. I'm sorry. <laughs> huh? Wow. She said and gave me a little wink. When she did, I could feel my heart race a bit. Stop messing with me. Dude, that is lucky. Well, anyway, I'm just happy to work with you again. Kagura answered, giving me an enormous grin. 
I don't know how much good it will do, but for her, I'll give this audition everything I got. Of that, my resolution was strong. She, so Yamato can look at her boobs anytime. That's pretty cool. That's cool. She's really happy. Wow, so one month just went past by like that? Whoa, what a big time skip. Kaigo puffed out her cheeks in dissatisfaction at my response. What's wrong? Why are you making that goofy face at me? Even I can't be being like emotion, like showing emotions and everything. You think so? She really laid down the law. Well, if a goddess says it's true, it must be true. Alright then, what should I do? I don't know if I can do that now, man. Seriously? Well, as a way of staying positive, I guess it might be kind of important. Oh, dear lord, I have to get rid of hers. Alright, alright, I rehearsed it. Yeah, I got it. A one, a two, a three, four, five. Yeah! Let's do this! When Kagura finished, I pumped my fist and cheered. To tell the truth, it did kind of get me motivated. Right, now it comes to that clueless song, like it just like, oh, don't know what to do. The song. You mean you don't know? Blurting out my surprise, I suddenly felt like a fool. Saying this, Kagura puffed out her chest smugly, which was rather invigorating in its own way. Invigorating or invigorating? I don't know. Invigorating, I think it's invigorating. Okay, well, I guess you're right, but you shouldn't admit it out loud. Did you hear? She's an idea. Idea. Ikea. Um, well, let's see. Out of question, I rested my chin in my hand. First off, why don't we check the public's reaction to the qualifier? I think it's important to check how you guys were seen by the public. If we know what people liked or didn't like, it will be good will be a good reference point for the future. You don't actually understand, do you? She's just like, hmm, 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 what you saying? Oh, come on, man. Sticking out her tongue, Kaigo gave a cute little smile. Oh, well, thinking was supposed to be my job, as she just said. Anyway, let's just check reactions on the net. It's like one guy on YouTube, he's like, Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, it's Kagura! The guy. So you're saying you'll never check on your own? I see. For some reason, that made me happy and somehow shy. Of course, it's just Kagura. So I know there's no deep meaning there. I'm gonna check the net. Okay, looks like we're ready. Anyways, I'm gonna have to end it here, guys. Hope you've enjoyed it so far, and see you next time. Peace out, yo. This is Sparks Dynamite.